coverage on 9 News at 10. It's all right here on WAFB Channel 9. And now, Healthline with medical correspondent Elizabeth Bow. Welcome back to Healthline. There is a unique program at Baton Rouge General Hospital called Arts and Medicine, which uses music and arts to erase the stress of patients. Today, the program featured the renowned Bayou Harpist, who had a very special reason for wanting to share her talents with the hospital. I have been playing for 30 years. <laughs> I do have my own personal story with uh, the Baton Rouge General. In 2004, um, I was expecting my first child and um, my baby was delivered stillborn. And the staff just reached out to me so well um, in my time of need. And when I became pregnant with my second son, I came back. So there's no way I would go to any other hospital. Music is a therapy for me, and I found that it's a therapy for many, many people. No matter what walk of life you're from, uh, what your state is in life, um, be you up, be you down, um, no matter your religious background, music is an international language that speaks to everyone's heart. Miss Hilda Gautier, artist, by the way, is pregnant again and will deliver on Monday, if you can believe that. So, so congratulations to her. Some national news now. A controversial diabetes medication could be available to a lot more people thanks to an FDA ruling. An FDA panel urged lighter restrictions on the medication Avandia. Avandia was thought.